Hello guys, good morning friends, welcome back to the channel. If you're new then welcome, I hope you stay. Um, today we are going to the gym, here is the fit. Pretty basic, pretty cute. Today is leg day, hope you guys are excited. I actually like leg day to be honest. Like even though it's hard, I actually like leg day because it makes me feel like I'm doing a lot of work. Because leg day is the day where I'm always the most sore afterwards, so it makes me feel like I'm doing a lot of work all because I'm sore. But anywho, here's me getting dressed and putting on a cover up. And do not ever forget your headphones guys. Please do not ever forget your headphones when you go to the gym. Like come on. And grabbing my phone and we are out the door. I usually don't eat before I go to the gym, which is really bad. I don't eat and I don't take pre-workout, which mm, is debatable for some people. But here I am packing my water and getting a banana. Shout out to everyone who hates bananas. I feel like a lot of people don't like bananas. But here we are. Off we go. Okay, so after signing in, I go ahead and take off my cover up and I put in my headphones and then I just get ready to go and stretch. So since it's leg day, I mean, usually I try to, whenever I stretch, I try to focus on like the muscles that I'm working on. So like, you know, since it's leg day, I try to focus on stretching my legs. But um, for the most part, I usually just do like a full body stretch, like before and after, and also in between working out as well, in between sets. So I just do a basic full body stretch, my legs, my arms, my back, hips, you know, lunges, just all around, stretching until I feel like I stretched enough. And then I go ahead and head into the little theater room to start with my cardio. Okay, so I start with cardio. Today I'm doing the treadmill, and I usually do the treadmill for 30 minutes. Either I do the treadmill or the Stairmaster, but today I chose treadmill, and I start with walking on 2.5 with no incline, and then the fastest I ever get to is about 6 miles per hour, and that's when I'm full on running. And then if I ever get tired of running, I just walk on an incline, so probably like 3 miles per hour on an incline of 3. And then maybe I'll increase my incline from there. But there's that. And then I start with um, calf raises to warm up. Usually for all my exercises, I usually do four sets of 12, sometimes three of 15, and then sometimes three of 10 if it's something that I'm really new to and that's something if it's something that's really hard for me. But usually for like all my regular work workouts, I usually do four sets of 12. For majority of the workouts you see, um, in this video, it's most likely four sets of 12. But here I am doing my calf raises. Y'all, I'm a beginner. I would like to point that out right now. I've been going to the gym for like four months. I don't know. I'm I'm a beginner. That's all I have to say. I'm very much a beginner at this. So don't judge me too much if my form is off. Critique me, but please be nice. Thank you. So next I go into goblet squats and I do 4 sets of 12 or sometimes 3 sets of 15. But y'all, I still don't know how I feel about these. Like, they make me feel good, they make me feel like I'm doing something, but I feel like I can't really tell if it's really working my legs that much. Honestly, it be feeling like it's full body. Like, I feel it in my arms, in my abs, in my back sometimes too. Like, it feels more full body than like a leg workout. And I try to hit a 90 degree angle. I don't always hit a 90 degree angle, but... I try. A win is a win. Next is my two arch nemeses. The leg extensions and the contractions, I guess you will. 
so I again I do four sets of 12 with this one but I try to increase the resistance each time so I'll start off at six and then I'll do like two sets of seven and then the last set of eight sometimes I do two sets of six and then two sets of seven because sometimes ages be feeling a little bit too much but I try to do six seven seven eight um, for four sets 12 times these are very killer. I mean, I feel like this one is... Both of them be making my legs shake, to be honest. But I feel like this one, it's a bit better for me. Because at least I can see the muscle growing. But, like, the ones where I um, push my legs back for my hamstrings. Oh, baby. Those hurt so bad. <laughs> And I definitely do have to stretch out my hamstrings after this set and also in between sets because them things really do be burning. Okay, so next we have a leg press and I start off with 70 and then I increase to 90 and I think I do four sets of um, 15 on this one. Leg press, like it's become a bit easier for me. I don't usually do this, but on this particular day, I decided to be different and I tried to do singular leg press like within just one leg and so i had to put it on 50 because the 70 was just too much for me and i don't feel like my legs are strong individually i feel like they're stronger together so i jammed out a little bit and i did my right and my left on 50 and i think i did i think i only did this for one set to be honest because I, I wasn't sure how i felt about it I found this cool trick on how you set up for Bulgarians where you put your leg out first and then you put up your back leg and then that's the position you're supposed to be in to do your Bulgarians but um I don't usually do Bulgarians just because I don't know how I feel about them once again I mean I know they're good for like your legs but like I just know that they're really good for your butt I'm not trying to grow my booty that's not my focus I just want to grow my legs so, but anyways, I did these, and this was like my second time doing these, like ever. And I did three sets of 10 because these are new to me, and I did them without weights because, uh-uh. So three sets of 10 on each leg. This is the second to last workout. We are almost done, friends. So lastly, I just did some lunges holding some 10 pound weights. And I couldn't decide if I wanted to do regular lunges or the reverse lunges, so I ended up doing both. And I think I did four sets of 20. I really can't remember, but I think I did four sets of 20. And so I would do like one set um, stepping forward and then the next set reverse, and then another set stepping forward and then another set re reverse. So then I just go ahead and stretch one last time before I leave. When I stretch after my workout, it's more of a deeper, longer stretch because you know, my muscles are sore. So that's what I'm doing here. And then I catch up with my friend Melissa because I ran into my friend Melissa. But yeah, that's what I'm doing here, just stretching.
All right, guys. So, just finished my workout. Today was leg day, but don't I just look ripped all around? Like, I focus on legs today, but I feel like I just look like ripped today. I look like ripped right now. I'm definitely gonna feel this tomorrow or later today. I don't know, I feel like I look ripped. Like, I feel like I look like. I did something. Hey guys, I just got out the gym. Just finished leg day and I feel good. I feel pretty good. Like, I can't really see the muscle <laughs> because I still have a lot of fat on my legs. But I actually feel pretty good that I only really see my muscles coming in whenever I'm doing the actual workout but afterwards like I don't really see much of a difference but I can feel the difference like I already feel sore and also like I feel sore like in my whole body not just my legs and while I was working out I saw some abs coming through I said oop <laughs> but um yeah that was leg day hope you guys enjoyed that I'm on my oh let me not do that hey okay, hope you guys enjoyed i'm on my way home back now so i can take a shower and get something to eat yeah let me know what else you guys would want to see give me some tips okay don't be me because i'm a beginner okay i'm not i'm i'm new to this gym life I, i'm not a gym rat like the rest of y'all but give me some tips on what i can improve on it was pretty awkward filming in the gym but i do it for y'all i do it for my 12 viewers Goodbye guys, I will see you in the next video. Toodles!